Hello and welcome to KLM Institute. Today, we're going to discuss a significant development in international politics. The United States has recently called for a global sanctions campaign against the Russian news network RT, citing concerns over its role in intelligence operations. However, this move has not been well received in New Delhi as India remains reluctant to follow Washington's lead. Let's dive into the details of this situation and explore the reasons behind India's response. Title India Rejects U.S. Request to Ban Russian Media The U.S. has recently called for a global sanctions campaign against the Russian news network, RT, but this move hasn't gone down well in New Delhi. According to the Hindu, India's government seems reluctant to join in on Washington's latest push against Russian media. On Friday, U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken announced new sanctions targeting Russian outlets like RT, accusing them of acting as a de facto arm of Russian intelligence. He claimed these networks were working to undermine democracy both in the U.S. and internationally and to erode global support for Ukraine. Blinken urged other nations to treat RT's activities as they would any other Russian intelligence operation within their borders, pushing for a unified diplomatic campaign. Despite the call, India has remained quiet. The Ministry of External Affairs has not given an official response yet. However, according to diplomatic sources cited by the Hindu, India typically does not follow unilateral sanctions unless they're imposed by the UN. Indian diplomats have said privately that the issue doesn't directly concern India and the country will stick to its independent foreign policy. Former Indian Foreign Secretary Kanwal Sibal, who has also contributed to RT, criticized the US sanctions, suggesting that they reflect double standards especially in the eyes of the Global South. He confidently stated that India would not respond to American pressure on this issue. Thank you for joining us for this important update. If you found this video informative, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to hit the bell icon so you never miss an update from KLM Institute. We'd also love to hear your thoughts on this new development. Drop your comments below.